Hi, my name is Matthias Schott and I'm a member of the ATLAS collaboration here at CERN. We just published a very important part of our research. What we did in the past five years together with our colleagues here was measuring the mass of one fundamental particle known as the W boson. Finally, we achieved a precision of 0.02%, which was believed for a very long time to be extremely challenging to reach here at the LHC. Measuring the W has been a challenge for physicists ever since its first observation because of its special decay signature. To reach such an extraordinary level of precision, the ATLAS team had to be on top of their gigantic detector in the complexity of all its components at a level of 8 per mil. They had to meticulously correlate each individual measurement to well-understood physics processes instead of relying on the initial detector calibration. Even though one doesn't know the W boson from everyday life, in fact it plays a very crucial role. For example, it is responsible for radioactivity, but also for the burning of the sun. In more theoretical terms, it's one of the force carriers of the weak force and was already predicted in the last century. The W boson is indeed a very well-known particle to physicists. Theorized in the 70s, it was discovered at CERN in the 80s. This was a fantastic confirmation of the standard model and still today one of the absolute highlights of our field. Since then, the next generations of experiments produced more and more of these particles. There were a thousand by the 80s, tens of thousands in the 90s and more than millions today at the LHC. These ever-increasing samples allow more and more precise measurements of the properties of this particle. Such precise measurements are important for us because the standard model predicts definite relations between the masses of the four heaviest particles known today. Now, what we can learn from this result? First of all, we just measured a fundamental constant of nature, which is great by itself. For me, even more important is that new physics models like supersymmetry predict a different relation between the W boson mass and other fundamental particles like the Higgs boson. Since our measurement confirms the standard model prediction with a precision of 0.02%, we can constrain many of such new possible scenarios. And we already know how to improve the precision in the future. And maybe we observe then some deviations from the standard model prediction, which would open a door to new physics.